Okay, okay, I get up. I get up. <laughs> this story isn't about me. It's about you. I should probably lay out that I'm not the hero of the story. There is a hero of the story, and at the moment, she's sleeping. She's a high-ranking officer, the lead educator, systems administrator, the 24-hour on-call nurse, purchasing manager, the captain of the ship. She's the head coach of the team. Where's mommy, Arthur? Arthur, where's mommy? My son even knows this. As for me, I'm the assistant coach. I'm the seven o'clock shift. The role of the assistant coach is simple, to ensure that the equipment and facilities are well maintained, training equipment is accounted for, various administrative duties, cooking meals, the purchase and pickup of large equipment, and if need be, step in as head coach from the hours of seven to 10 a.m. You need your greens? This morning, we're working on player evaluation and offense drills. Two. Player number one has exhibited real potential. Three. He's 38 days shy of his first birthday, weighing in at 23.5 pounds and 24 inches in height. The bulk of his height and weight comes from his head, which he most likely inherited from the assistant coach. He's an excellent eater, crawler, and a swing napper. He's a vocal boy. He always has a smile in his pocket. And when he cries, he pulls a Brando. I've come to think of this story as analogous for difficult tasks in life. Life, after all, is difficult. Navigating a life of wants and desires is difficult. Getting them or not getting them is difficult. Gravity is difficult. Gravity is difficult. The average baby age for walking in the United States is 12 months. So far, we are on track. What's interesting is this is life's first challenge the beautiful thing is I can see that he wants to walk. He wants to be there already, but he doesn't know how to make it yet. Twice a week, the head coach goes to work as a nurse at the local hospital. She leaves at 7 a.m. and returns at 8 p.m. If you don't eat your greens, I'm gonna tell your mama. That means twice a week, it's 13 hours of assistant coach time. Oh, oh boy. Ooh. Most of my time is spent discovering things she's already taught player one. To him, we're just running the routine. Very nice. Good morning, Arthur. Exploration skills, check. Oh no. No, please. Oh man, I'm getting teary-eyed also. Motor skills, Woo. check. I do beg your pardon. Casually assaulting robot vacuum. I am not a carousel. You probably got that one for me. <laughs> Sounds like you want that. No, no. Okay. Let's face it, the assistant coach only has two tricks. You feel a little bit better? Got that load off your chest? Uh, when did you have corn? All right, rear end is perfect. Let's check the tires. All right, tires are full. Dad, 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 dad. Mama, mama, mama. Dad. 
dad, 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 As I watch him struggle, I draw parallels to my own challenges. <laughs> Overcoming obstacles doesn't happen overnight. It's a process. It's always been a process. A series of small increments that build off each other. Now what most parents already know and what I'm just catching on to <laughs> is just how fleeting this all is. These challenges, these moments, these sounds rank in the few untouchably golden moments of my life. They are simple, pure, and incorruptible. I'll admit it's a bit wistful to think that this is the closest we will be. In his journey towards the unavoidable strive for independence, something we all must seek, we will be relegated to the sidelines. Not so fast. A friend messaged me after Arthur was born. Remember the tiniest moments of Gossamer. Beauty barely glimpsed, then gone. Only to exist in your memory forever. Teach him and learn from him in equal measures. Impossible as it seems. Your love grows bigger. I'm reminded that this is by design. The point of life is not to nail it on the first try. The point of life is to improve. It's for that spark of courage or imagination to separate you from your life before, to push on. The point of life is for the magic that happens when you overcome something scary, something you didn't think was possible. The point of life is for you to go through these things yourself so that you can help others go through them as well. Arthur! <laughs> <laughs>